Hey y'all, it's your girl Sashi E. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are gonna be taking out my hair, y'all. It's been so long since I've actually sat down and actually spoken to y'all because I've had my hair in now for about 21 days and I've just been doing DIYs on my channel. I haven't done anything face to face to see you guys. So hey, welcome back. And um, so I've had these in for 21 days and it's about time for them to come out. Um, when I originally did them, I told y'all I was gonna keep them in for only two to three weeks and it is three weeks. And to be honest, I don't wanna take them out because it's been so nice and easy just having these in. You guys, when I did my hair, I wore them down, I think, for two days. Because you know when you do your hair, it's like tight, so you can't pull it back right away. So I had it like this for, like had it down for two days. And then you guys, I've had it in this bun for the past like three weeks. So I haven't done anything to it. It's been just really nice just getting up, taking off my head tie and going about my business. The only reason why I even have on some edge control right now is because I had um, church service this morning and we use Zoom and I like to show my face and I didn't want to get on there looking ratchet. <laughs> so I was like, you know what? Let me just put a little jam. Well, actually with some edge booster, let me put some edge control on there. And that's what I did. So I'm gonna go ahead and take them out. I'm sad to see them go, but the good thing is I do know how to do my own hair. So, you know, I could always put them back in after I wash and deep condition my hair. As you guys know, I did my big chop in February. I forgot the exact date, but I did it in February. And I'm trying to regrow my hair. The longest my hair has ever been was uh, mid back length. So I'm trying to grow it like really grow it and I feel like in order for me to do that um, I have to make sure that I wash my hair frequently deep condition and so forth if I didn't care about my hair growing or whatnot I would have left these in for six weeks but I care about growing it out and it's been a while since I've deep conditioned it and washed it and so forth so I want to just go ahead and do that after I take these out okay so one final look I do reuse my Marley hair, so I'm gonna take them out and reuse them. I'm actually gonna count how many um, twists I have in my hair, just to give you guys an idea, you know, how many there are. So it's 38 on this side. So I have 78 twists in my hair. Give you guys a little turn. Okay. So um, I have some tools with me just to help me out. <laughs> have a wide tooth comb and I have a fine tooth comb. And I also have uh, three little uh, rubber bands or elastic bands to kind of help me separate things. Um, it is 327. 327 and I have my computer right here I'm about to put on living single that's my new favorite show right now on Hulu so I'm about to put that on and I'm about to get started so it should be pretty easy to take these out I don't anticipate that they'll take a long time it is a twist but I did plait about one centimeter at the top so all I have to do is pretty much just put my hand in, just pretty much pull it apart. Hold on. <laughs> it's a little tangled, so let's see. The ends are a little tangled. Let's see. Okay, perfect. Okay. That's my hair. It feels really nice and moisturized. I don't have any buildup, not that I see. As I told you guys, I'm keeping the hair, so I'm just gonna hang it over here. Wow, it's pretty easy. It's 
so this much hair came out of this little section right here so at the end I'll show you guys how much hair came out in all so let's do just one more at the front so you guys can see I'm starting off by just unraveling it here and then I'm gonna go up a little bit more unravel it right here oops unravel it again and then take out the braid at the top okay then I'm gonna take my white tooth comb I'm gonna go through it Ooh. I feel like I'm experiencing a little bit of shedding, but you know, it's been 21 days, so should be, shouldn't be too much. Comb through it and put that to the side. And yeah, I'm gonna do every, I'm just gonna do every other part. I don't see a lot of buildup, which is really good. And yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. I'm done with the half of my head. This is how much hair. Has come out so far. And I have half the Marley hair right here. Still looking pretty good. That's why I'm going to reuse it. So I'm gonna do the other side really quickly. So this is all I have left. The last one, <laughs> the last one.
Okay. <clears throat> Whoa. <laughs> all right, guys. So I am all done. Oof. This is all the hair that was in my head. And I, as I told y'all, I always reuse my Marley hair. So I'm about to put this to the side and wash it later on. And I can always use it as a ponytail or I can, you know, do the twist again. So as far as my hair, this is how much hair I lost. I feel like this is normal for three weeks worth of hair loss. You know, you lose hair every day and it's been up for about three weeks. So I feel like that's pretty normal. I'm not concerned about that at all, especially because my hair used to shed super bad in the past. So this is nothing. So I want to do a little bit of a length check um, just to kind of see, you know, if my hair is growing. I did do a big chop in February. So let me see. Okay, let's see. So it's about here. And then for the sides. It's about here. And then for the back, let's see. We could do the back. So the ends are a little crusty. Okay. Can you see that? Nope, you guys cannot. The back, Let's see if I could sit up a little bit. So it's by past my clavicle, it's right here. All right guys, so this is my hair. Um, I just removed my rope twist and this is it. I do need to go ahead and wash it, so stay tuned for a wash day routine. I actually did two wash day routines uh, before, but I didn't like how the footage turned out, so I deleted them. So hopefully this one comes out really nice, and that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.